Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Ashley from Ashley X Brenda. And today I'm going to be showing you how I got this look created. It is a nice, like, red, glittery look. I'm aiming this look towards Valentine's Day. You also want to make sure your makeup lasts a long time. So when you're doing this look, make sure you have a lot of time on your hands. It took me over an hour to do this. Today I used a Too Faced Glitterly from the Nikki Tutorial slash Too Faced Collaboration NYX Glitter Primer. So this is definitely two things you need to do this look, of course. The Anastasia Modern Renaissance Palette. Like I said, you can use whatever look you want. You just want to make sure you use glitter with this look to give it a really dramatic effect. Now, guys, without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and start the video. Let's get this look started. So, first, to start my face off, I'm gonna start with the Mario Badescu Skin Care Facial Spray with Aloe Herbs and Rose Water. And I just got this, and I've used it like a couple times, and I literally live for it. So, I actually got a little free sample of the Tarte. Clean Slate Timeless Smoothing Primer Base, and it's really cute. It's in a small little container. It literally looks like a miniature version of the full size, and I'm gonna be using this as my face primer, but I'm also gonna not leave behind my next pore filling. This does have a very thick and heavy consistency, but I don't mind that in a primer because I feel like it'll just like make it stay. I can honestly see my skin like gets, it looks smoother. Like, I don't know if you can see it, but I can see it like right here. My skin looks really smooth. Alright, so now I'm going to go in with the next pore filling primer. And just because I've already primed my entire face, I'm just going to go very light on this. Like, when I say I mean very light. So, I'm going to like loosely spread that all over my face. And now let's start with the eyes. We're going to go in with our Smashbox 24 Hour Photo Finish eyeshadow primer and we're going to take a little dab of this. So first I'm going to go in with the Airspun Loose Face Powder. I'm going to use this nice dense fluffy brush and I'm going to take just literally a little bit of this powder and I'm going to set my primer. Ooh. This powder smells like grandma <laughs> but I kind of I dig the smell. I'm taking raw sienna and I'm applying that on the outer V of my eye and it's gonna be also a transition tint. Make sure you bring this all the way inside. Before you need product, just go ahead and pick it up. It doesn't matter if it's not blended right at this point. It's honestly, you're not gonna see this color by the end of this look, I promise you. Now I'm going to take Burnt Orange in this in this palette and I'm going to apply that on just the outer area. I'm taking Red Orchard and applying that on the outer V of our eye again. Taking this the red orchard again with this nice fluffy Anastasia brush and I'm gonna drill it into my eye. Now with this fluffy angled brush, I'm gonna go in with Love Letter right here. brush and start on the inner corner of my eye and work my way out. Now I'm 
now with my e.l.f. eyeshadow C brush and my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the shade Medium, I'm going to carve out my foot crease. You need to pay very close attention because you need to get them as identical as possible. This Tarte Fine Liner Brush and I'm going to get the concealer that I talked about using and then I'm going to create the nice line. So now for the moment we've all been waiting for, we're going to start off by using the NYX Glitter Primer. I'm going to apply a little bit of this. I don't want to say one. I've actually never used this before, so. I'm going to test my reviews that I write up on. I'm going to apply it where I ooh, placed the concealer at. Now I'm going to get my um, glitter in the shade Glitterly by Nikki Tutorial's Too Faced collaboration. I'm going to take this nice little flat uh, design brush here and tap it on. It's going to take a good minute. And now we're going to quickly repeat that same step with the other eye and then we're going to perfect and go back in for a little bit. With our red oyster in the bottom of this brush and perfect our crease one last time. And brush off or try to brush off the excess fallout. We're done for the eyes just for right now. Remember we've already primed our face. I'm just gonna go ahead with the L'Oreal Total Coverage in the shade 308 Sun Beige. My real technique sponge. I probably look really like Edward from Twilight right now. I could look like a vampire. Now that the foundation's on, I'm gonna be mixing two of my faves right now. The NYX HD Studio Concealer Corrector and then the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in the shade Medium. I'm <laughs> going back in a Real Technique sponge. I'm gonna stab that in. Now I'm gonna get the Airspun Loose Powder. This is the lid. And I'm gonna apply it where I put my concealer. So you wanna make sure you clog your pores. Bake. While it's baking, we're gonna go ahead and start with our bronzer. We're gonna be using the Hula Bronzer by Benefit. Okay, now we're gonna go back in with our eyes. Wow, there's literally powder all over everything in front of me. Gotta love some face powder. Under my eyes, as in like right here, right under our waterline, I'm gonna go in with a mixture of red orchard and the like other red next to it, going back and forth and hitting that under my eye.
now with this pencil brush, I'm gonna take Primavera from this palette with this pencil brush and hit that under my eyebrow bone. Gotta look shiny all the time. And with the e.l.f. eyeshadow blending brush, I'm gonna blend this color down. Vivid Baked Highlighter, and this one is in the shade Radiant Light. I thought I was gonna get the peach one, but I just grabbed it without looking, and I kind of regret it, and it's sickening. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and put this mascara on, a very light coat, because we're gonna be using eyelashes totally. Now I'm going to go into my Ardell Lash Book and I'm going to go with the style 117. It's the Glamorous and there's this last pair down here. So I'm also going to use my Duo Lash Glue to apply these. Now I'm going to go in with my all-time favorite red lipstick, Rico by the brand Stila. Now to finish off this look, I'm going to use Urban Decay All Night Makeup Setting Spray. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure you like and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Make sure you leave any comments about future reference video ideas. Maybe to go in depth in a certain part. But make sure you don't leave without subscribing down below. I'll see you next week.